Welcome to romanticizing your life with me. Now I know most of us have heard this, but romanticizing your life is living like every day is your last. Now that may sound sad, but tomorrow is never promised. So why not enjoy the life you're living now while working towards the life that you dream of? My morning routine is something I truly cherish. I get to spend the most time alone to myself with my own thoughts, and it's so peaceful. How I start my day is waking up, not going on my phone. My skincare routine, I love doing my skincare routine, feeling clean, brushing my teeth, obviously, and then I make my bed. After that, I go into my morning rituals. So that is morning meditation, gratitude, and reading. Good morning, my love. Welcome to a guided meditation. Start every morning with a grateful heart. We are so blessed to live another day of life. Be excited for this new day full of opportunities. Environment design is powerful not only because it influences how we engage with the world, but also because we rarely do it. Most people live in a world others have created for them, but you can alter the spaces where you live and work to increase your exposure to positive cues and reduce your exposure to negative ones. Environment design allows you to take back control and become the architect of your life. Be the designer of your world and not merely the consumer of it. So this morning I made French toast. I actually have never made French toast ever in my life, so fun fact. But I wanted to do something that I've never done before and live like I'm in a movie and have a delicious, beautiful breakfast that I made. Look how delicious! Good morning, beautiful people, hello! We're romanticizing our life. I dropped a piece of bacon. I don't know, not only today, but from now on for the rest of our life. Because like I said earlier, not every day is promised. So I know the camera angle or lighting may have switched because my other camera died, but we got this other one. So as I was saying, I am gonna bring you guys along my whole day and just living like every day is the best day ever. Even though we can't control the bad things that happen in our life, we can control how we react to them and how we let it affect us. So you know what? Every day we're gonna live our life like it's a freaking movie. We are the main character. You're the only you out there and you're the only you playing in your movie. I am going to eat my delicious and beautiful breakfast that I made. Like I said, I've never made French toast before so we can do a little taste test together. Mmm, bomb. What the hell? <laughs> I'm a chef, I'm a chef. I did make some of my greens. So that, you know, kind of balances this, this meal out. I'm gonna eat this and then we're gonna get ready for our day ahead of us. Plus, we're going on a trip today, which I'm so excited for. A few minutes later. We're going to San Diego and I'm so excited because I love going to San Diego. It's so much fun over there and so beautiful. I'm going for one night in a half a day. We're going to see this DJ out there. Oh yeah, it's gonna be pretty fun. I of course have to go get my little workout in before I go on my trip because discipline and priorities. When you look good, you feel good. I love going to the gym. If you know me or have been watching me for a while, I am like a little fitness lover. I am going to do glutes and hamstrings today. I just need to get my outfit on. I already put a pile of <laughs> stuff on the floor right here that's my stuff it's just not in a bag um i packed myself some snacks for my little trip my little road trip so that i don't get hungry because your girl always gets hungry i haven't used this camera since like sophomore junior year of high school and i'm a sophomore in college now so yeah it's been a minute but this is the fit today this ice cube shirt it's my boyfriend's i just take all his his clothes i just take over my bed i paired it with these blue navigation dupe leggings from amazon they are so cute and then we got on <laughs> the blazers let's go we're gonna put on some music that unfortunately you guys can't hear because copyright but jam out to whatever your heart desires and sing your heart out like nobody's watching you and if they are go ahead and give them a show that's another thing i am so tired of people being afraid to do what they really want just because of what other people may think about them or how they're going to judge them or might not want to be friends with them who effing cares like i cannot say that and praise that enough but sadly a lot of people let those kinds of ideas or things stop them from doing what they really want to do so this year in 2022 i want you guys to not only romanticize your life but do whatever makes you happy 
and whatever serves you and if people want to stick by you and support you and be cheering you on on the sidelines then those are your people and whoever doesn't and judges you and laughs at you those aren't your real friends those aren't people that you want in your life the first part of romanticizing your life is being in love with who you are because you spend the most time with yourself so start falling in love with you self-love being your number one supporter and number one cheerleader is the most important before anybody else. You need the support from yourself and you need to believe in yourself and know that you are capable of doing whatever your heart desires in this world. This year is all about growth and becoming a better version of ourselves than we were last year. We're not gonna spend another year of doing the same thing that we did the past years. Doing whatever makes you happy is the most important. This year we need to learn to put ourselves first because sometimes in the past I know I haven't done that, but this year it needs to change. Making yourself a priority is not selfish. Your movie, your life. Do you for you, not anybody else. You only get one life, so live it to the fullest. Chase your dreams, be who you want to be, do what you want to do, and live by that every day you wake up. I hope this motivated you to start romanticizing your own life and how to do it. Don't forget to subscribe if you enjoyed this kind of content. Go ahead and give it a like and comment any ideas that you guys have for any future videos, and I'll see you guys soon. Love you. Bye.